we are looking at a good example of a tooth sectioning surgical procedure and in this case it's used to remove this impacted wisdom tooth. If you want to earn a CE units, we do have an online course on wisdom tooth removal. Just follow the link in the description and uh, you will find it there. Impacted teeth are seated deeper and tighter, hence requiring this next level procedure. The sectioning procedure involves cutting the tooth into smaller sections or pieces to make it easier to remove. The surgeon makes an incision in the gum tissue to expose the impacted wisdom tooth. Then, using dental instruments, the surgeon will carefully section the tooth into smaller pieces. Each piece will be removed separately, starting with the largest and most visible section. However, there are instances when the surgeon may need to remove some of the surrounding bone in order to fully extract the tooth. If you want to earn a CE units, we do have an online course on wisdom tooth removal. Just follow the link in the description and uh, you will find it there.
After the tooth has been removed, the surgeon will close the incision with sutures and place a dressing over the area to protect it and help it heal. Pain medication and antibiotics may be prescribed to manage any discomfort or infection. If you want to earn a CE units, we do have an online course on wisdom tooth removal. Just follow the link in the description and uh, you will find it there. Thank you for watching. We'll see you again soon.